a moderate. He's very moderate in his uh, approach to things, and he believes in peace. He considers peace. Two years after the suspension of the traditional New Year salutations to President Porbia because of COVID-19, the events resumed this year at the Unity Palace. The number of delegations, however, was reduced to 38. It was a huge crowd of diplomats and other very important personalities present at the Unity Palace. Among them were ambassadors and representatives of international organizations, Senate President Marsenia Ntifenti, National Assembly President Kabayegi Jibril, Prime Minister Chief Dr. Joseph Diongute, were those who opened the ceremony. Then it was the turn of several government ministers who came to say Happy New Year, Mr. President. The Gabonese ambassador to Cameroon, Paul Patrick Before, spoke on behalf of members of the diplomatic corps and representatives of international organizations. He thanks Cameroon for a strong and positive diplomacy. Le Cameroun est depuis six ans marqué par les conflits et tragédies que vivent les populations au nord-ouest et au sud-ouest. Outlining efforts which according to them are to bring calm to warring far north, northwest and southwest regions. Je voudrais au nom du corps diplomatique Exprimer l'espoir que ce conflit soit réglé dans les plus brefs délais. President Prabhi has said the war in Ukraine plus COVID-19 has greatly affected economies worldwide, especially that of Cameroon, hence the need for subventions from international partners. Je voudrais toutefois plaider pour que la communauté internationale accorde un intérêt plus accru aux situations de crise et de conflit ayant pour théâtre le continent. And at the end of the ceremony, President Prabhia took off some minutes to give brief instructions to visitors and his subordinates at the Unity Palace. A vous-même et à vos familles respectives, j'adresse mes sincères souhaits de santé et de succès pour l'année 2023.